morning, my Mr. Tribe. This is Mystic Jen, and this is your daily read. This is a general read, cannot, will not resonate with everybody. These readings are timeless. This could be your energy or someone you're dealing with. Male, female, could be vice versa. First card out that we have is the message. This is definitely spiritual messages coming from the great divine. Angels, archangels, spirit guides, source, God. You know, there's downloads coming from the heavens to us now. There is a divine message that spirit has. High priestess of water. This is tuning into your intuition. This is tuning into your emotions. This is getting deep and in touch with our inner selves. This is trusting our inner guide, trusting our intuition. The warrior. This is spiritual warfare, my friends. Wow. Okay. We are experiencing some kind of spiritual warfare. And this is trusting your intuition, trusting your instincts. This is about fighting for what you believe in. This is perseverance, standing up, and messages that are coming through from the great divine that is trying to guide you through this warfare that you are going through right now. We have the fox. This is thinking outside the box. This is some kind of, this could be the other woman. In some instances, some people call this a trouble card. This could be being beautiful and sly. Bear, this is some kind of big trouble coming. There's something wrong. And this is probably calling you to look at the bigger picture, the ship. The rider. There's some travel going on right now. And this is also messages or packages coming. This is messages coming from afar, from some protective force trying to give you a warning about something that is not quite right. And that's why you need to trust your instincts and intuition. Garden, public. This could be a public service message just coming through that may be affecting you in a big way. I'm going to stick my neck out here and Spirit just told me something about China. So there could be something in the news that maybe you should not trust. So I think China is symbolized by the bear. Correct me if I'm wrong. Or is it Russia? I don't know, but there seems like there is some kind of false information coming from the media that involves as coming from overseas so <laughs> you know this feels like today is a day that the public is going to be in shock zone uh, or or sometime in the very near future that there is some type of false information that is coming from whoever whatever country that the bear represents overseas Maybe somebody could drop a comment and let me know. But it feels like false information coming from this country is coming overseas messages that is going to be affecting the public. But the public has to be aware that this information is false. And maybe they're not. Ring commitment contracts. This could be government contracts coming from overseas. This feels like a global message here. So be aware of that. On a personal level, this could be someone that you trust who has been 
a big authority figure in your life might be sending you messages and it's coming from afar. Maybe they're not in your immediate area, but they may be a public figure of some sort, someone in your life that there could be a public scandal concerning someone in your life. Or something becoming, some knowledge becoming public. Maybe there is a scandal of another woman, love affair of some sort, with somebody in a place of authority having that love affair, and the information is going to be made public. It's like somebody getting caught. So this could go in a couple different directions depending on the context and depending on what's going on in your life. And here we have war, the warrior. Maybe there's rumors of war somewhere. That's going to be very emotional. And there's messages coming back and forth. This could all be tied into this as well. False messages that, you know, it's, it's going to cause an uproar here. Ah, anxious to see what the tarot has to add to this. I think this is a public service message. You know, this happens once in a while where instead of being a really personal daily read, it's something on a global level. And I think that's what this is. That I, I honestly think that this reading is about a country that's on the other side of the pond from the United States. If you're in Europe and you're watching this, then this is somebody on your side of the pond that's affecting us that deals with the United States on the other side of the pond. Okay. I definitely feel like it's overseas. Something's happening here soon. Okay, we have the moon card. Again, that's instincts. Tempers, major arcana. This is about peace. You know, may, there may be a false sense of peace here. Mmm. This is peace and harmony and balance. This is also a card of Sagittarius. This is a card of Cancer. Or Pisces, I'm sorry. There is definitely some hidden agenda here. This is hidden agendas. This is falsehoods. There is definitely something more that lies underneath the surface that's not being revealed here. And then there's the temperance card coming in, which is peace and balance and harmony and healing. And it's falling right underneath the bear. So there might be messages a false sense of peace from whoever the bear is but underneath the surface there's still some kind of hidden agenda here three of wands the, the, the three of wands this is working together this is e-commerce you know if this is china they may be trying to restore trade with the united states trying to keep peace but there's some kind of hidden agenda there Knight of Cups, Ch Knight of Chalices. Finally, we got a knight here and we got a rider. So there is messages of love and peace. Ooh, this is getting deeper, my folks. Two of Wands at a crossroads. So at least the public at a crossroads of decision making. It is like the need to move forward. Underneath the deck is the Four of Wands. This is about our stability as a nation. This is definitely a world message. This is about the general public. This is, this is not a personal read, I do not feel. 
I think this is more global, affecting everybody, affecting the world. I think this is the third or fourth reading since I started throwing Lenormand into my daily readings every day that I have come across that's a reading that was based on world events. And that's what this is. This is some false sense of security being offered by the bear for the sake of trade and e-commerce here wanting to work together and we had the ring under here this is a commitment this is a contract i think this bear is wanting to offer some kind of peace treaty because we have peace here with temperance this is peace and harmony this we have negotiations communicating back and forth messages we have messages going back and forth between countries and it's go it's overseas it's uh, it's countries across the pond from each other you know it's affecting the public it's affecting the world and the two of wands is typically someone who has the world in their hands the world at their feet who is looking at the globe and saying okay what next i need to let something go to move forward there is some i feel like that there is compromises going on but what is bothersome about the whole scenario is the fox card and the moon this here screams a falseness hidden agendas this is a falsehood this is hindered agen hindered, hidden agendas. So this country here is going to pretend they want peace. They want to restore trade and have harmony and everybody get along. But it's a false sense of security there. <coughs> because we have the warrior. He is about war. He is about making trouble. And we have the messages and we have the high priestess of water she is a deep sea of emotions this is an emotionally charged situation this country is really I feel in desperate mode and there's a lot of emotions overseas that is going on. And there's a lot of things. She, this this high priestess of water. She is very deep. And she is. Talking about. And if you look at her. She almost looks mysterious. You know. There is definitely this sense of something. Much deeper. Than anybody understands than the world really understands wow i think we're in trouble i'll be perfectly honest i really do anyhow this is the messages for today i wasn't expecting this at all but here it is anyhow that's what i have for you Please do give me a thumbs up, subscribe, share, and comment, and I will see you in the next video. Blessed be.